Hello everyone and welcome back to Rhythm Entertainment. I'm back with the fall. Um, I was doing every video in kind of like a sequence and I kind of messed up that sequence. So I'm continuing exactly the same spot I am. I just went above the shaft where the baby was. I um, am not exactly sure what to do here. I kind of read up and I think this is what I need to do. That does not work. Okay, so there's something I have to do to make that fungus explode. That's what I gathered. I really didn't read much into it. Uh, it says it has to root into it. So there must be like fungus up here that obviously is coming down into there and it makes it something. I don't, I, I, I don't know. Maybe it's this one. Let's find out. God damn it. Controls are still very wonky. Ah, yep, that's it. Okay. Okay, so now I can go back down and um, do what I need to do with that baby. Now, I feel kind of bad for cheating but not really because I was stuck on that for like a really long time so I had to look it up and it's not one of the reasons I stopped playing this video is uh, this game because I do like this game it's just I had so many stuff that I wanted to put out but I wanted to continue this part of the fall so here we go moving on from the baby test it says now I need to sh shoot that okay now that I I would have never guess that. And I, like I said, I'm good at point and click games. I just I would have never guessed that. Not not in a hundred years. So now I was saying that you need to activate this, start the baby test, and you actually suck the baby up. I feel really test. bad about this. <laughs> I have completed. Evaluate. Processing dust detection. Processing. Baby has stopped crying. That's horrible. Validated. Merit point awarded. <laughs> that's that's pretty horrible. But okay, look, it's done, and I did what I did what I had to do. Whoa! Okay, those could hurt me now, so now I gotta be careful. So now we're back with Betty, right basically where we started off. Now I have to go up into the uh, civilian area and complete all these civilian tests. So I don't know anything about these. As you saw, I was stuck with the baby test, so. Is this a test? Graduation. When you successfully complete your evaluation, you will be allowed at ground level. You will undergo a final hardware evaluation, then be rerouted to shipping and receiving. I discovered another hung body. What has happened to the humans who ran this facility? The caretaker has made some modifications. If you fail these evaluations, you, and likely your human, will be depurposed. I will not allow that. Continue your evaluation. I'm not a military grade robot. I have anything even. How invasive is this hardware evaluation? I must be certain my pilot will not be endangered. One of our highly skilled technicians will. Don't worry about it. There are no technicians left to meet you. Once you're through here, you're home free. Okay. Can I bypass these tests? Channel that persistence into your evaluation, Aaron. Okay. I will return. Let's do these stupid tests. Let's see what this guy wants. Who's that there? Be with you and help an old lady across the street, you know? I need to see my grandson at the playground. Walk in front of these cars so they'll stop for me. 
Follow me. It is safe. Huh. Whoop. <laughs> Whoops! <laughs> I got hit by a car. That's hilarious. Who said this? Keep your talk in front of these covers so they'll stop for me. Follow yeah, me. What? Oh, yeah. Who's that the walk in front of these covers so they'll stop for me? The playground is <laughs> arid, especially when. Uh, whoops. Who's that there? Dig with the air and help them walk in front of these covers so they'll stop for me. Follow me. Oh. If the track is broken, what the hell do I do? Alright, let's do the other test. Come back to that one. You there, help an old man fix his truck, won't you? I don't know what's wrong with her. Many humans feel more at ease when addressed with subservient colloquial language. When you have finished the task, talk to the driver and tell him, give her a go now, sir. This is a simple machine. I am certain I can fix it. Oh, I got to do nothing with this one. I have completed the repairs. Hmm? Give her a go now, sir. <laughs> yep. There's that again. Validated. That was easy. Okay. This one. Come give me a push, robot. Don't be a prick. Ah, doesn't move. Requires a serious amount of torque. Ow! Okay, do this one then. So what this one's about. The youngest party will not commence until all guests have arrived. Go assist the missing guests. Betty must be pissed, because that's pissed for Betty. Levy, this here is deducting where the fungus keeps creeping in. Wilson said she wants it maintained. In other words, do a better job than Brian did. He was a decent enough guy, but a lousy maintenance head. Still, no sign of him, by the way. My advice is to use the caretaker. Oh, use the caretaker and get it done quickly. It will follow me. It followed me in here yesterday. I guess it wanted to be helpful. But it was doing a hollow skin thing and it started looking like Brian. Maybe it was trying to be comforting or something, but it wasn't. It was just creepy. Oh. The ARID Mark 7 has violated the testing perimeter. 
You should not be here. State your purpose. I am exploring for means by which to better aid my humans. Futile. This area is not pertinent to your evaluation. You are outside the jurisdiction of domestic assessment. Should it? May I ask you some questions that are not relevant to my evaluation, please? Futile. Proceed. I have found bodies, both human and machine, hung throughout this facility. Please explain. I follow my operating parameters perfectly. Your... I am bound to protect my pilot from anything. Irrelevant. If you are the facility's caretaker, how has it fallen into such disrepair? Do not evaluate me. There are many mechanisms I oversee, and many roles I must perform. All is more efficient than it was. Huh. Do not evaluate me, why not? Your holographic plating cells shift frequently. Who are these faces you represent? My protocol necessitates adaptation to be of optimal service. Will you adapt? I will do what I must. You should not be here. Return to your evaluation. Awesome. Don't be a dick, robot guy. God damn. I got all the manic gun now, so I'm happy about that. <laughs> I think I had a crouch. Those weird bees at the bottom. Ah, it's he. Thank you. Oh, I need this power grid, am I right? Yes. Oh, okie dokie, put that back on. Alright, now remove the power cell. Okay, does not work. I don't know what that's about. Aha! Hmm. I don't know what I'm doing here. Particularly. Yeah. Hey, Brian, it's been a while. We've been having some problems keeping all the security droids online. We generally function fine, but if more four of them enter the chamber at once, we, we run out of power. I modified the modulator here to accept high voltage tier two power cells. Hope that's okay. I've seen that caretaker droids inspector for whatever for, for whatever reason so far is working great. Just want to leave you a heads up. It's, Heads up, not 
to use it anywhere else, though it might be funny to see what would happen <laughs> to put too much juice in other stations. Okay. Let's get back to the party and get that merit point, shall we? So what do I need to do here? I assume everyone's here. The Yemen's party will not commence. Hmm. All right. For now, that's that. Till next time, Betty.